Hello fellow Breeze Bookers and welcome to Breeze Books. Today I'm reviewing Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen and I actually just finished this book not too long ago so I would give this book probably a 4 out of 5 stars and I think that the plot is very interesting. I think that it's very well written and I like all of the drama that it has, all of the plot twists and unexpected things. It's not a story that I would say is predictable at all. But the reason I'll give it four out of five stars is just because it's written in an older English. And I understand that if it's written in older English, it's going to be harder to read and to understand. But I found it to be very hard to comprehend. And I found some of the vocabulary to be a little bit challenging. Um, and a lot of words were used to say like some of the simplest things. So it was kind of excessive at some points, but I do like the character development. All of the characters are very well developed and the plot. And I'll read the um, summary to you guys. Jane Austen's first published novel, Sense and Sensibility, is a wonderfully entertaining tale of flirtation and folly that revolves around two starkly different sisters, Eleanor and Marion Dashwood. While Eleanor is thoughtful, considerate, and calm, her younger sister is emotional and wildly romantic. Both are looking for a husband, but neither Eleanor's reason nor Marion's passion can lead them to perfect happiness. As Marion falls for an unscrupulous rascal, and Eleanor becomes attached to a man who's already engaged. Startling secrets, unexpected twists, and heartless betrayals interrupt the marriage games that follow. Filled with satiric wit and subtle characterizations, Sense and Sensibility teaches that true love requires the balance of reason and emotion. And I picked up my copy at Barnes & Noble. It includes an introduction and notes by Laura Engel. So in the beginning is the introduction and at the end there are um, notes and things like that. And there's a few like questions and discussions and comments, all of that. So if you read that ahead of time, I feel like it's kind of helpful and some of the notes are helpful in explaining what's going on. And my copy was retail price for USA is $5.95 and it's a Barnes & Noble Classics and you can see the little like logo right there. So I would recommend this book to anyone who's just into reading classics, anyone who wants a romance, something dramatic with a good plot. And as far as the movie, I have seen the movie before but it was several years ago and I remember feeling like I enjoyed it and like it was a good movie. Um, I'm excited to rewatch it after reading it and see if my opinion has changed at all. And if you guys are interested, maybe I can do like a follow up video, but I haven't rewatched the movie yet. So when I do, maybe I'll let you guys know. But thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time on Breeze Book.